That must be Torn Odin. Maybe I should check in. Get out! We're almost at the gate! And Odin's run over four minions of darkness! <laughs> the boss is our head! I'm driving with one hand! I need you to meet me at the shore. Is the song ready? Almost! Odin's got a killer chorus! Roll tree! Tree! What tree? There's no tree in the song! Who the fuck put the tree in the middle of the road? Drive carefully, Grandpa. Pedal to the metal, bro! Metal to the pedal! Yeah! <laughs> Very rock and roll way to drive. Saga. Now keep moving. The lights in the containment cell are good to go, Anderson. Great. A Torin Ode in there yet? <laughs> the two golden oldies? Well, they're here. And they bought moonshine. I love them already. <laughs> they're alive. You wanted to know what art we would use? Well, that's them. I'll be there soon. One, two. One, two. One, two. How you feeling tonight? Told you. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Been a while since we played on this shore. all of them. Testing. 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 
Gonna need more reverb. I'm getting no bounce out here. Hey, where are my chimes? I threw them out. Chimes are not rock and roll. Yeah, hey, there you are. I'm here. If you know, I'm, I'm here. here. Let's get ready. Anderson, we've set up control center up here over the area. Anderson, I can drop more gears down for you if you're running low. I'll use the lights to hit the taken when they come. Light them up for you. Bad news is, we were in a hurry. The power supply is spotty. Your partner here will try to keep it running. I'm not a damn mechanic. I wish your tech guy was here, Karen. Kiddo, we're ready to rock and roll. Just say when. We're ready when you are. We're waiting for your signal, Saga! This will be a show for the ages! Ages! We'll play this at maximum volume! You signal me when the song is done, and I'll use the clicker to bring Wake back. Hit it! Hello, Cauldron Wake! Great to see so many federal agents here tonight. Prepare to experience a soul-searing, mind-frying act of black magic and sorcery! This song goes out to our favorite tortured writer. Let these sweet tunes guide you out of the darkness. It's called Dark Ocean Summer Name. <laughs> hey, you're making me look bad in front of Saga, bro. <laughs> uh, let's try that again. <laughs>
the power of rock and roll. Make it real? So where the fuck is he? I don't have time for this, so let's get it over with. Tell me, was this all fake? A show? No one said otherwise, Mr. Wei. It was to indulge you, but we can start pretending now. Uh, masks come off. Oh, I wouldn't go that far. I don't even think you know who's under your mask, but you know how to make things difficult for yourself. All these rules, endless, convoluted loops you insist on going through. You are so lucky, you know. There are so many people helping you. Armies of people. Myself. Your wife. Alice. I need to get to her. She's in danger. She is. Because of you. And so is someone important to me, someone you pulled into this. You keep opening doors, peeking in, reaching through to get what you want, and that puts you in my path. I don't know what you're talking about. I have to go now. Maybe you will make it through this time. This has gone on long enough. This and our night springs, it was a nice distraction. It's time someone gave me a straight answer here. The next time we meet, the circumstances will be very different. And you would do well to return the favor by playing your part. Or stay out of my way, Mr. Wig. Whatever you say. Door, Zane, the masks were finally coming off. Was it a sign I was closer to escaping? I had no time to waste.
at the end of the tunnel. Jumalauta, that held you close, Tom. Ei muuta on, vaan set the granny in the snow. When the panic is biggest, the help is also near. Thor didn't seem happy to see me this time. Hearing the master is the root of wisdom. But don't let the game get you down. He's playing his role. Maybe put him in your films, Tom. Like you have put me. Herskel, say an olisk. What films? <laughs> I'm a fan of your masterworks. Uh, there is Tom the Poet, my favorite. And Uerden Uer is the most famous one, of course. And is it true what I hear? That it's coming back to cinema soon? Is there a bottom to this rumor? I need to get back to my apartment. Can you help me? Well, plan is half done. You asked me to make sure you won't forget the... 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 light pictures. The photos you artist wife took. They are waiting in the shoebox in the basement. What you leave behind you find in front of you. Okay. Thanks, Adi. find Alice's photos in a shoebox. These were Alice's photos. I recognized the style. One showed the clicker sinking into darkness. The other showed a light in the shape of a bullet. They were important, even if I didn't know what to do with them yet. Light is a poisonous, poisonous dart Forever seeking out the darkest part Forever, forever, forever your heart Dart. 
drowning. I'm drowning. I'm drowning. No way out. There's no way out. It's deeper and deeper and deeper. This is hell. I'm now I died. I wish I was dead when I die. I just want to sleep. Please. Let me sleep. I'm so tired. I just want to go home. I've written so much. I write. I write. There's nothing left. It's all gone. I don't know how to write. All the words are gone. There's no more words. Where's it going? Can I get the words? I don't recognize these words. You are the words for me. To get to Parliament Tower, I needed to find a murder site. Zane would know where to find one. Inside this messy maze of blood trails I was chasing the cult through, I ran into the filmmaker. Thomas Zane, an esoteric bohemian with a hard-on for acts of cruelty performed in the name of occult nonsense. A director wants to control every aspect of the world in their films. Is a cult leader any different? Was Zane just another alias for Scratch? There was a rumor that Wake and Zane had been working on something together. I was going to get the truth out of Zane, with whatever means necessary. based on my interpretation to change that which I observed. It was all a play, shadows on the wall of the cave, an echo of the true events that happened somewhere else. Was I there to watch the shadows, or was I a shadow too? In a performance, 
set up for someone else. Zane's room, 665, was upstairs. The elevator would take me there. Something told me Zane wouldn't be happy to see me this time. I'm in control now. The second you try anything, I will shoot you in the head! Scratch wrote return, not me. You're a fucking liar. You'd given up. You stopped writing. You said it was too dangerous, that, that we didn't deserve to get out. And then he showed up. Scratch, he promised to write. To get me the hell out of here. He was magnificent. A visionary. finished. It took return and left me behind. It's still here, and so is he. I know I fucked up. But you can still catch him before he gets out, before he gets to your wife. And when you get to him, don't hesitate. Kill the bastard for what he did to us. There's a murder site. In my cinema, where my film Nightless Night is playing. I told you not to try anything! Thousands have gone missing beyond the labyrinth of me. When you're lost, you're lost in your own company. And cut! <sighs> oh. Now that is drama. I had a million questions about Zane, but I had more pressing concerns. I had to find the movie theater Poet Cinema. The next murder site was there. Zane had created the film in tandem with Return to escape the dark place.
I could see the searchlight beams of the movie theater on the far side of the plaza. The cinema lobby was a gateway to other realities on the silver screen. I could set a scene here. a new draft of the story. I felt like I'd been on this case looking for the cult of the word for a lifetime or more. The only case I'd ever been on. They would surface from the dark with their depraved acts of Did I stop writing at some point? Back into the night, I can't stop. Leaving behind There's too much at stake. Bloody crime scenes and clues. Lifetime or more. The only case I'd ever been on. They would surface from the dark with their depraved acts of violence and fade back into the night, leaving behind bloody crime scenes and clues heavy with obscure meanings that led nowhere. Arriving at the cinema, I felt them monumental, 
terrifying revelation trembling before me, ready to open its jaws and swallow me whole. This place had significance to the cult. There was something to use there. I needed a new draft of the story. First step toward the murder site. I was making progress. I was missing something. Someone had barricaded themselves in the room. I needed a new draft of the story. Then I needed a new draft of the story. One that would get me ahead of scratch. ceremony, and so we made our new members believe. Two of New York's finest, they had performed endless favors to earn their place among us. We had something special waiting for them, and something very special for you, Alex Casey. Who's your leader? Alan Wake? Hmm? Scratch? Zane? Give me a name! <laughs> You will meet him soon enough. There was no end to the corruption. It fit the genre, so I'd use it. Pretending to be a secret society. Maybe it is you who's playing a role, Mr. Casey. A role carefully laid out for you. A puppet blindly performing the ritual steps for the glory of the cult. Huh? What the fuck have you been smoking? Nightless night. A clip of the lost film survived. You will see, Mr. Casey. In the nightless night, you will finally see. Nightless Night was Zane's film. It played a role in this story. Come on, these birds. 
Good scene for dark deeds. I had to keep working on the story. this initiation, do you? Nah. I'm sure we'll just chant some ceremonial stuff. N nothing to it. Well, it's about time. We paid our dues. Made plenty of their problems disappear. Dumped all those nobodies down that chute. What we did or didn't do, it's all behind us now. We're going straight to the top, partner. Yep, like we died and went to heaven.
Straight to the top. The dirty cops look down on the city. Their city. They... Hey, Tim. New map, huh? Yep. Look, I've never been to New York, but I can tell you that this ain't it. I heard you humming again. <laughs> yeah, I... I can't get this song out of my head. It's a real earworm. I heard it in my dreams. I know that song you keep humming. It's... The theme from Night Springs. That old sci-fi show? Sci-fi horror anthology. I used to write for a long time ago. Look, it sounds a bit nuts, but I think the song is connected to Door. Or, it's my subconscious telling me that this is all pretty out there. me, Mr. Casey. I'm all yours. Go ahead. Ask that burning question in your mind. How did you do it? How did you get me into that film clip without my remembering it? Talk to me, damn it! You've seen the film? Good, good. Now you're ready to meet the Grand Master. He's waiting for you in the projection booth where everything will be revealed, where he will project a new reality to this one. And now, Mr. Casey, I've played my part to the end. No, no, no! Crazy bastard! Why'd he jump? The projection booth. Was that where I'd find the murder site? <laughs> 